I was sitting in the backseat of a bus, which was going at 120 kilometers per hour. A fly rose from my shoulder and flew right up front and landed on the drivers. So does it mean the fly was going faster than the bus? Let's let Newton answer this question. And that is, velocities can add. If you are a bystander looking at the bus and the fly from outside, you would say, yes, the velocity of the fly is the velocity of the bus plus the velocity of the fly inside the bus. Velocities can add. Now, of course, if you're inside the bus, the fly seems to go at a very slow rate. If the bus is really a rocket ship, traveling near the speed of light, and a fly flies inside the rocket ship, apparently breaking the light barrier. How's that possible? Well, Einstein would say that you cannot add velocities in relativity. The fly cannot break the light barrier. No matter how fast that rocket is moving, no matter how fast that fly is moving, you cannot go faster than the speed of light. Newtonian physics is wrong. That means that the two velocities have to be adjusted because of the fact that time inside the rocket has slowed down. Now this is amazing, but it works. And this has been measured repeatedly with our particle accelerators and our experiments.